the Circular Advantage program really opens your mind to seeing those untapped resources and those untapped potentials and how you can become more circular yourself. Like if we can harvest water and treat it and filter it and then use it somehow on site for something that we were using mains water for, that's truly circular. I work for Nestle at the Camberfield factory and I'm part of the manufacturing excellence team. Circular Advantage program really opened my mind to this concept of getting behaviour change through gamification and incentivising people because one of the biggest resources that we have on our site is our people and all the perfect circular economy systems in the world aren't going to make a real impact if the people who are using them are not applying them in the way they should be applied. And rewards are linked to our reward and recognition project we already have a lot of segregation systems in place, but if they're not being used effectively, then things that could have been getting reused or recycled or repurposed end up going to a landfill. We've got this giant roof of, of our factory and water is falling on it and it's just going down into stormwater. Um, systems and we as a chocolate factory are quite a water hungry process so the two of those should work really nicely together. We even have some products that the packaging is converted into on our site now so we have safety bollards, Kit Kat benches and picnic tables for staff to enjoy. When you step out and you collaborate with other manufacturers um, like we did in the program, you have other people's eyes on your situation and they go, oh, what about this and what about that? And you're like, oh yeah, of course, that's, that's something we could be doing. It was great to be uh, contacted by Hume and one of the things that Nestle is passionate about is being a part of our community and I really felt like we were. What business wants to spend money on resources and then not fully utilise those resources.